going on everyone got a 2020 honda pilot today i'm going to show you how to replace the remote key fob battery all right so the first thing you're going to want to do is remove the emergency key out of the bottom of the remote if you flip it over you'll notice that there's a switch right here you're going to just go ahead and push that switch to the right and then you can pull out the emergency key okay all right it's a little sticky so once you get that out what we're going to do is we're going to split this remote open and I want the buttons facing down. I'm going to use a small flathead screwdriver and I'm going to stick it in like this. I'm going to pry the remote open. Okay, it's just going to split in half. You can see, let's split just like this. Okay, and then take this. Now I want to hold the remote like this because this piece can come out and if it comes out, uh, all the little buttons will fall apart or fall out of the remote. We don't want them falling out in the car. I'm going to get my flathead screwdriver and just pry up on the battery and then you can just remove it that will get you a new battery i'll show you what size the battery is here's the new battery it's going to be a cr2032 this is a panasonic battery and if you notice that there's a positive sign facing us and that is going to be facing us when we stick it back into the key fob just like that if you need one of these batteries check the description box there's going to be a link takes you to amazon where you can get a, a new panasonic battery uh, pretty cheap so all we gotta do is just get the cover snap it back on and make sure it's snapped on nice and good so we don't want it to fall apart put the emergency kit back back in and then you're all done hope the video was helpful and if it was appreciate it drop me a like leave me a comment i'll see you again in another video